very interesting. Part two. <laughs> yeah, it, it clicked off and I didn't even know it. Alright. I believe the steak is done. The steak is done. The steak is done. Oh no. Oh no. It's still frozen. Still frozen. That's a good thing. Get that motherfucker back on. There we go. I heard it go. I love that sound. When that green light comes down, it will be done. It was still frozen. That's good. I, I, I love it. I love it, man. The last time I started the steak, the half a steak, the half a steak, last time I started it, is that when I was doing the dishes. I showed this motherfucker to make notes in here. That's all, Mike, you missed this one. Shit. Look, there's still a little bit in there. Mike Nelson missed that fucking party. Just, uh, why didn't you fucking call me? I didn't know it was my goddamn job to, uh, to call you up and say, hey, you want to come drink up my shit? Because he was. He, he, he drank that whole goddamn bottle. He was and puked all over the motherfucking place and leave. I'm waiting for that green light to come out. I'm gonna lock the motherfucking door. I'm gonna leave my door open like this. I'm gonna lock it. I know it's really bothering Mike Nelson right now. Oh, the green light's on. Uh, now it's gotta be done. Oh yeah. Put that right there. That. Oh shit. I can get the blood. Turn this off. I like the blood. Yeah. I take the blood and I put it on top of the steak. Nothing wrong with a little, nothing wrong with a little extra flavor. You know what I'm saying? Just 
two eggs. The only reason why I did two eggs is because I want to save my food. You know, I'm going to save my food. That's, my mission is start saving. I'm, I'm done. I'm done with the... Uh, I'm done with Culver's. That was my last Culver's dinner. Because that's why I'm going shopping. Duh! Duh! That's why I'm going shopping. Yeah. That's why I'm going shopping. I'm going shopping. Remember, when I came home, I had to throw most of my food away. Yeah. I ain't proud of it. I'm not going to eat old rotten food. Picture time. Yeah. Okay, let's go eat. Turn off these lights. I love that air, air conditioning. Oh my god. Ceiling fan. Oh my god. I love it here. I wish there was a. I wish I had a backyard with a garage. I'd stay here forever. I would. I'd stay here forever. I would. Okay. I'd stay here forever. Yeah. One thing about this fucking Netflix shit, to get out of it, you gotta do a lot of fucking work, man. You gotta do a lot of fucking work just to get out of this shit.
Okay. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, no thanks. Ah. Uh, enter. Let's go with some raw. Y'all know me. I gotta have my entertainment. Okay. Lord, I love to give you thanks for this food that I'm about to eat. And may I ask that you always keep me healthy and strong. And Lord, I thank you for helping me with my illness. And I know you will guide me to better ways. Back to happiness joyfulness and healthiness. Lord, please bless me and get back to work soon so I can start making that money. And please bless me with my YouTube channel so I'll get that big pet paycheck and have something to retire on. I love you, Lord Jesus. Amen. You may be wrong with yes. Okay, let's start with this steak. So if Brock Lesnar doesn't end up in that ring tonight, your contract is coming. I think tonight, Brock Lesnar does go out. Oh my god. I don't give a crap about the WWE universe. That steak is so good. We're on the schedule to be here tonight. Stephanie uh, asked me to move. Maybe I just say, I should just say, fuck that. Officers. Whoever I steak, I just get tongue steak. All right. Spoon steak. The spoon steak is only six bucks a pound. You don't go out I could get a lot day. more steaks. They're perfect. Welcome everybody to Monday Night I wish I would get off work.
wish it would have took the six a little longer. Yeah. It's not falling apart. I can get the floor. Welcome to Monday Night Brawl. Tonight will be an historic night because making her raw in re debut tonight is the baddest woman on the planet, Rhonda Rousey. And unlike some other former UFC champions, Rhonda has no problem competing on Raw. I don't have to beg her or she doesn't whine or complain, but I can tell you what, whether she wins or loses tonight or beats Alexa Bliss at SummerSlam, Rhonda, just like every other superstar on Raw that shows up each week, as a champion in my book. I wish I could say the same about Brock Lesnar. Watch it, Kurt. Oh, hold on. I need to get this off my chest. Brock Lesnar has no class. You saw what he's done to the WWE Universe, to the Universal Championship, to me. Okay, I'm a man of my word. Because Paul Heyman was able to get Brock Lesnar down to the ring before the end of the night last week, Paul Heyman's job is still in fact. Paul Heyman is done. I mean, it's too done. Now, he will be interviewed by Renee Young later on tonight. But as far as Brock Lesnar's attack on me, this is what I'm going to... Well, the big dog has come to Monday Night Raw. Biggie's just falling apart. The most polarizing superstar in WWE today. Let's remember, Michael Corey, that Roman Reigns left the building a oh, week ago. He wasn't even inside in Miami. Roman Reigns left the building at the request of Kurt Angle so that Kurt could make an effort to draw Brock Lesnar into the ring. If an airplane would have been on top of me right now, I would die with a smile on my face. Yeah! But this breakfast is good! Woo! Oh, I forgot to add salt and pepper. Oh, well. I thrive in it. He said, I hope that Brooklyn is ready to get loud because I'm ready to give you a show and win the Universal Championship in two weeks at SummerSlam. Go, Roman Reigns said a lot of big nights in his career. But you can argue, I know it's not WrestleMania, but you can argue that two weeks from last night will be the biggest night in the career oh, of yeah. one at Roman Reigns. I love this team, man. Half and half. Oh, I love it. I'm hurt. You know, I got a lot of respect for you as our raw general manager, but you should have known better. You should have known better. If you kick the big dog out, who's going to protect the yard? Exactly. Nobody. And that's why Brock Lesnar ragdolled you all around this ring last week. Uh, what are you smiling at? Yeah, it looks like an overcooked what, <laughs> what did you do? When he was getting beat down, what did you do? Yeah. You just stood there, didn't you? And then what happened? As soon as Brock looked at you, what did you do? You ran. You ran like a scared little old. Nobody likes what Brock Lesnar did last week. And that starts from the top down with the WWE. Hold on, top down. Hold on. 
Please tell me you're not going to say what I think you're about to say. Please tell me y'all aren't going to suspend Brock Lesnar and death. Please tell me you're not going to try and postpone this match at SummerSlam, man. You cannot do that. Listen, that's not going to happen. I made sure that Brock Lesnar did not get suspended. And I made sure that you will compete against Brock Lesnar for the Universal Championship at SummerSlam. I just hope you kick his ass. Wow, that's a sound bite. That's also really unprofessional for the general manager. You can't pick sides, you can't play favorite. And if Brock Lesnar was here, he would. He'd what? He'd do what? He'd look at you one more time so you can run off like a coward again? I didn't run off. I chose to be the bigger man. That's something you know nothing about. Plus, I'd already yeah, I already that time. It. I was worn out from being a tiny, thin valor. You know the I'm guy sonic. that actually won yeah. the Universal Championship. On I'm sonic. Yeah. And I mean, I'm pretty much already doing everything around here. I can't possibly think of anything else I could do. Well, even though it's red inside, you could have acted like it. a man last week. Yeah. Act like a man? Are you an example of what a man acts like? You shuffle out here week after week and greet these people and welcome them like it's your show. Stephanie McMahon is the commissioner of Raw. You, you just make magic. And Stephanie put me in place as constable to watch over your every move because you can't be trusted. You're right. I just make the match. And you know what? I see a match right here. As a matter of fact, I want the referee to come out here right now because Cosmo Corman is going to take on Roman Reigns and the match starts right now! Oh, I love it! This is not fair to Corman. How's Corman going to ring the bell? Oh, oh! oh shit shot! Bell rings! Match underway as we await for the official to make his way down to the ring. I love the fact that Corman didn't wait to yell at Kurt Angle. He took a shot at Roman Reigns. Uh, Baron Corman with a cheap shot. After this match, the same official... Yeah, I was thinking like it was yesterday. Right hand, Shocky Roman. I think that Corbin was a cheap shot, but Corbin was warranted. The constable didn't come out here right now to compete. He came out here to make sure that Kurt Angle did his job properly. And now we're right on the side. Puck to the constable's down. Here's the cover. Puck on the line. Official in play. And a kick out at two by Corbin. Yeah. Roman Reigns and Baron Corbin on your way. That probably overcooked it. Yeah. I probably will quick yeah. I, I get just very stabbed with my pork. That ain't right. I'm sitting in sauna. I'm sauna. Maybe it's undercooked. I don't know. Well, we try to understand our customer needs. So we included no minimum balance and access to 40,000. Could be undercooked. I don't know. Why? Because we care about our customers. Why? What? These are important questions. Why? Take advantage of a checking account you can't get anywhere else. Talk to us to get started today.
It ain't like it's shitty or nothing like that. It's good. You smile at me then. Maybe it's undercooked, I don't know. But it does look burnt on the outside. Very cocky, very important, very confident Roman Reigns. Exchanging words, leaving this match. Maybe if it's burnt out on the outside. With the right hand of Corbin last week in the hospital, Reigns is being uh, escorted out of the building. It's red. And Roman, oh, and a big boot. I can't stab it. And now we're going to start to feel it. Oh, my God. Yeah, I think it's under court. Oh, the valuable few moments to try to... Get his wits back. It seems like a mistake to me, but do a lot of question Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns locked and loaded. Measuring the constable, went for the Superman punch. Corbin caught him. Went for the choke slam backbreaker. And Reigns able to counter. Uh oh! oh two, 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 two. Is it enough to put Reigns away? What a win this would be for Baron Corbin! Oh. And a kick out of it, too. So close for Corbin. And I agree with the reaction. That was as close to three as you're ever going to get. Look at this. The big dog full ahead of steam. Corbin just too powerful, using Roman's own momentum to drive him right to the center of the ring. Possible Corbin uh, getting frustrated after he could not put Roman Reigns away. Yeah, I didn't think well, I was being frustrated. I was being encouraged because he has been special. Here tonight, losing my touch. Roman Reigns, everything he can handle, live on Monday Night Raw. But well, yesterday was perfect. Absorbing a tremendous yesterday was perfect. And that punishment continues. Boy, these two are just going back and forth. They're going to need another team. Corbin had the end of days in mind because Roman saw it coming. He countered with a couple big right hands. Oh, Ben is going to get me another tee. Oh, oh, this is the tee top of my uh, Roman Mark Schoen. Or not Mark Schoen, but. Well, I'm going to have to switch it over.